hello guys welcome to c learning so in this video we see how to add missing devices in ensp so uh, missing devices like uh, we have a number of devices uh, which need image file to run on ensp so here we have some any 40 any 5000 and any 900 and cx routers here we have some switches ce 128 series switches and uh, uh, ce 68 series switches so uh, you can download complete ENSP setup from here so I will give you this link on description so you can easily download uh, all ENSP setup uh, from here uh, easily and uh, here you will also file the uh, firewall image file any 900 9000 image file and all other CXRA switch image files and also the ENSP setup and also the virtual box which is compatible to this ENSP and some other uh, software that needs to install ENSP so you have to install first of all you have to install the virtual box then this WinP cap and then Wireshark and then you will install ENSP and then after ENSP just go and register the devices as I told in my previous video that how to install ENSP you can find the link on above so after first time install just go here and in tools and register the device just click on all and the register the device so all of the device will be registered all the, these devices air router which don't need any image file and this AC routers and some firewall this firewall these uh, firewalls don't don't need uh, image file so firewall USG 6000 need image file so you can find it from here this extract this file and then import the files so I will import some other image files like uh, if I pick the any 40 router and I right click on it and start it so it will ask me to import the uh, image file so just download it here so I have already downloaded all of them here and I will Im import this file so this is any 40 so I will go in browse and then from here in PC and then in downloads I will go in my location where I keep this file so this so this is the any 40 so I will go in any 40 and just select this image file and import so just click on import and this file will be import in this device after that you will start this device and this device will start working so uh, remember one thing that you need a good laptop and with good specification good ram and good cpu and good memory to run all these devices otherwise these devices will not run will not work on your uh, device you need a very good pc and very good system to run all these devices so I have import the device now right click and start and it will start after some time it will go and start uh, so let's go on any 5000 right click it will ask me to import file so uh, just give him access it will ask me to import file of import device any package so we will import so we'll go back So we'll go here and then we go in downloads ENSP and this is the any 5000 so I will go here and import its file so just import and then right click and restart this device so image has been copied all the packages copy has been copied just right click and install it start it in the same way you can also import one by one in all the devices so just to start it will ask me to import the file of any 9000 so i will go ensp and then any 9000 package import and then so in the same way you can start this cx just browse sp and cx import cx image file import it and also you can import the file for some uh, ce routers or ce switches just go here ce6 ce was 128 so uh, i have one file of it let's see just go here and then ce import the file here it will copy file after that these devices will start and work normally so you can use these devices if you want to use these devices 
in the same way you can uh, import so this has been start without any uh, image file so uh, ce 6800 need image file so this is the 6008 uh, image file and also usd so i have already install uh, import the usd file so this usd 6000 we also need image file so you can find it from here so i have already uh, import the file on this firewall so it will not ask me to import again so only one time it ask you to import again first time when you uh, install the ensp it will ask you otherwise it will not ask you so any let's see any it's going to because uh, it's the very heavy devices so it takes very uh, more time uh, in as compared to normal devices to start and work normal so start this as well and let's see any devices is start or not let's start all the devices let's see any it's also working so after some time if your windows specification and your pc specification your ram is good at least 32 gb ram you need to run all these devices and 1 tb hard disk and a good cpu to run these devices so you can uh, in the same way you can import packages and use these devices all other devices are free and you can imp uh, just right click and install this uh, option and also you can file this free software i will uh, provide you the link in the description of this software so you can uh, go and install the ensp and import the devices So hope you like the video, thank you very much.